That was like the most adult thing you've ever said, Fred. Well, because it's just annoying. I didn't buy it to get ruined. It's like I'm living with a child. Hey everyone, this is Chris from Real Rideshare Stories. How's it going today? So I got another good story for you. Uh, this was just from the other day. Uh, it was just kind of funny conversation between a couple of guys who are in college talking about a couple of their roommates. Um, moral of the story is, I feel for you guys. Uh, check it out and I'll see you after. Have you guys like talked at all, Fred? He keeps trying to talk to me now. I think he thinks we're good. I mean like maybe like Talking it out could help. No, I'm not about it. I mean, yeah, you have to be about it to like do it, or else it won't mean anything. Yeah. If you ever feel like to be about it, you know. No, because every problem that we've had it hasn't changed. So why would I start talking to him again? Because he's made no effort to actually fix anything or stop doing things. Like he still like touches your stuff. And shit like yeah, that. like he Jay still lives in the apartment. He still texts me 24-7 asking for things. He keeps asking me if he can touch my stuff. I'm like, no, stop. If you want to cook so bad, then maybe get your own and stop, like, destroying mine. Like, he, he keeps putting non-stick aluminum pots and pans in the dishwasher. You know what? I don't even know why I paid for this stuff. That's, like, the most adult thing you've ever said, Fred. Well, because it's just annoying. I didn't buy it to get ruined. It's like I'm living with a child. How do you not know how to- Dude, Will doesn't know how to use a dishwasher. I'm like, Will, why do you keep just leaving plates in the sink with eggshells in the sink? He's like, well, we don't have a dishwasher. Like, where do you think a dishwasher would be other than right there? Yeah, but even if we had Wait, do you have a dishwasher? Food, food goes in the garbage. Yeah, the eggshells- I've been telling my roommates that, like, they- Some of them, like, just, like, Rishi, like, they just put food, like- In the sink. In the sink. That's like- Someone had a- Yes, thing. yes, we have a food, like, compactor, but, like- I'd rather, yeah, but like, clean, Will, I, I almost throw up cleaning the dishes. It got to the point where every single one of our plates, bowls, little plate things, everything, forks, knives, was in the sink at one point because Will and Dylan kept cooking. Yeah. And yeah. neither of them ever cleaned a single thing. <laughs> yeah. That, like, and then I, me and Matt, who never cook, would go down and be like, oh, this is ramen that's been in here for three weeks. Yeah, like, we, we have a <laughs> schedule. Like, we just have the next person, do, like, we have a schedule and rotate yeah. it. And, like, every time, like, I'm not doing it for a day, like, I don't cook anything. And then there's like a like a mound, like a yeah. mountain of dishes. And I'm like, how did you guys make this much food in this short amount of time? Dude, put it like this. There's literally a steak in the fridge. The downstairs kitchen fridge of my room. I don't have anything in that fridge anymore because there's a steak in there that is so old it's growing spores. You know? That's gross. Yeah. There is a full gallon of milk that expires tomorrow in that fridge. And there's a gallon of milk that Matt bought when Matt lived with us that no one has thrown out. Dude. Because I don't touch that fridge. The only things that ever get fixed are the things that I fix. See, living with me would be very different. Yeah, yeah I feel like, like we're all very like laid back people. Yeah. Because like I don't give people if they leave a mound of plates in the sink. Like but Damon, I'm not gonna. I Damon's like horrible. I can't see that from him. No, Damon's like such a nice Damon guy. Seems so chill. <laughs> Damon is chill. Well, there's potentials there right now, so hopefully... They got there early. All right, so that was pretty funny. Um, yeah, guys, learn how to how to cook and clean. <laughs> uh, I'm right there with those guys, though, so when I was listening to it and overhearing them, uh, I was just kind of thinking in my head, that's hilarious. Because, uh, yeah, I, I'm pretty uh, stingy when it comes to uh, wanting things cleaned up after uh, uh, people have been using them. Uh, if you talk to a few of my friends... They'll definitely uh, agree with that. Uh, I might not be the cleanest person for myself, uh, but when I'm out somewhere or with people, I always clean up after myself, and I expect the same. So it was just pretty funny. So I hope you guys enjoyed that, got a good laugh out of it. Uh, with that being said, that was the end of this video. If you enjoy these videos, make sure you subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, and you'll be updated every time uh, new videos have uh, been posted. And we'll see you next time. Still watching? That's all right.
This video might be over, but the fun doesn't have to be. Video up top, if you click that, that'll take you to the last video that we just did. And the video down below is what YouTube thinks you should watch. If you're not a subscriber yet, make sure you hit the subscribe button right over here. And we'll see you next time.